I was reading the comments on the last video and it reminded me of what someone had told me years ago. I was sitting outside reading a Paolo Coelho book called The Valkyries and someone sat down next to me and was asking me questions on, on the book. What I thought of it, what other books I've read, inspirational people that have, have read. And he turned around to me and he said, whatever list you, you have a look at, there'll always be a name missing. And it's true, if you do a Google search for the most inspirational people that ever lived, you'll find normally three lists. The first list being people that have come through rejection in their life, but still achieved greatness. Others that have come through failure, but again, come through greatness, achieve greatness. And those that have come through something traumatic. And when you look at the list, you'll find that people have been told that they're either too old, too young, too tall, too small, they don't speak correctly. You'll find others that were born without any limbs, that still manage to do the daily activities like everyone else. People who have lost limbs during their life, who have then gone on to achieve awards and trophies. The list is endless. And you'll see the same names all the time. J.K. Rowling, Thomas Edison, Walt Disney, all these people that have, have gone on to be who we know them as today. But there's still one name that's missing on that list. And the name is you. Your name is the name that's missing on the list. Because when I was looking at the comments that you left last time, people were telling me of their age, what they're going through, what they're about to go through, telling me the story. And I was thinking, if you go back to that story years ago of a young boy walking along the beach with his mum and he sees a thousand starfish washed up on shore, he starts picking them up and throwing them back into the sea. And his mum says to him, you know, why are you doing that? You know, they're all gonna die. And he said, if I can just save one, I'll be happy. And then a gentleman comes along and says to the mum who starts helping the boy, you know, what are you doing? They're all gonna die. And the mum says, if we can just save one, we'll be happy. And then the next thing, there's about 20 people on the beach throwing these starfish back into the sea with the same intention that little boy had. If they can just save one person, they will be happy. And it was your comments that inspired me to, to do this video today and have encouraged me and motivated me to get out and do another video because it's you that are going to inspire someone to go through what you've been through and achieve what they want to achieve. It's, it really is about pulling someone through with you, you know, reaching out with your story, using your voice, in my case, using a camera and a YouTube channel. But if you've got any fear or doubt in your life, just remember that your story and your position in life now, what you're experiencing, might be just the thing that someone needs to get them through the same situation. And that's why I do these videos, you know? I haven't got all the answers. I don't know what the answers are gonna be, but I just keep going. I've got incredible support around me. I've got people who leave encouraging comments like Evie May last week, who left a, a beautiful comment on the last video that they're the comments that encourage me to keep going. So thank you very much, Evie May. But just remember, it doesn't matter where you are or what you're up to. There's always gonna be someone there that's looking for that, that hand to help them through the situation. And it'd be your name that they remember. It'll be you that's helped them. They could come across this video in a year's time and read one of your comments and it might give them the inspiration and motivation to do the same. And that's why I'm grateful for people who do leave a comment. 
and are also honest with the comments as well because at the end of the day we're all in this together you know we're all going through life I don't think anyone has it all worked out but the more people that communicate and the more people that talk and use their voice or their skills that's what's going to help people you know but I just thought I'd share this video today because that's really the reason I didn't have anything planned and I thought I'll sit down and I'll go to all the comments and I've tried to reply to all of them. There was a lot of comments on this video. And that's why and that's why I did this one today. And the funny thing is, when you're doing these videos you make a lot of mistakes. You have to go back and start again or cut things out. I think I think one day I'm just gonna do a whole video of bloopers and things that have gone wrong while filming, but but just remember that one day someone will be reading the comments that you've left and it will inspire them. And it will be your name that gets them through that situation. So there you go. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you've taken something from it. And again, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think of the video. Let me know where you are in life, what you're up to. Let me know what's what you've done to get through a certain situation or to handle rejection or failure. Because you don't know who's watching, you don't know who's coming across the videos and, and reading the comments. So again, thank you very much and I shall see you in the next one.